I want you to imagine you've just spent nine months at 37 degrees Celsius just to be thrust into a room about 15 degrees cooler. Welcome to The Legit Dad. My name's Andrew and I'm here to support you in your early steps of fatherhood. Hit subscribe and the bell icon. I'll drop. You'll be notified when I'm dropping new videos twice a week. Okay, skin on skin contact for you and your new baby is an absolute must, okay? It's an absolute must for supporting your baby's transition into the real world. Baby's just spent nine months cocooned up inside mom's womb where it's been consistent temperature, consistent pressure around that baby's body, and that baby's suddenly coming out into a world which is completely different. So skin on skin contact is a, a, a technique where baby's obviously naked, mom or dad need to get your top off, cuddle and that baby in against your chest, providing that baby with that 37 degrees Celsius temperature that the baby is so used to. In the ideal circumstances, especially if you're going to be going for breastfeeding, it must be mum that does it as much as possible. But mum will be a bit busy after the birth, with a few medical checks and things that need to, be, need to be done. So the responsibility will have to fall to dad at some point while mom, that's happening to mum. Dad, you want to get your shirt off, get baby cuddled in nice and tight um, and really give that baby as much skin contact as you possibly can for as long as you can. Okay. And a few other benefits of doing that are that the bond that you will feel in doing that in the sense that you are providing for that child at a moment of, of need will develop this bond and it's proven in the science um, that the hormones that juiced in dad to create this feeling of love and compassion and warmth for this new baby uh, clinically proven in the evidence that this happens whenever the skin on skin contact happens okay also gives dad the confidence so nursing your new baby in against your chest gives you a sense of confidence that yes i can provide for this uh, new little person in the most like human sense possible this, this deep human need that the baby has but it just needs warmth initially dad can provide that gives you that confidence that and as i alluded to at the start Yes, that baby's temperature um, smoothly transitions the baby from 37 degrees we're in, out in the womb, gradually bringing them down to room temperature, hopefully in as smooth uh, a transition as possible, because it's, it's quite a big change for that little baby. And the more we can smooth it out, the more comfortable they're gonna be. I hope that's useful. You're watching Dills and Dad, I'm Andrew. I've helped you out all today. Hit subscribe and the bell icon, and you'll be notified when I'm dropping new videos twice a week. Thanks for watching, guys. Speak again soon.